Hey everyone, uh, Pastor Jim Beard here, Director of Congregational Care at Good Samaritan United Methodist. My pronouns are he and him. You know, all this talk about, um, you know, where your treasure is and, and how we maybe chase after so much that is about uh, money. I, I just have to go back to one of my favorite authors that he, he wrote this book, I Always Take on Retreat, because it just settles me down and gets me focused in the right way again. Uh, his name there, there's the name of the book, uh, is Sabbath. Yeah, Finding Rest, Renewal, and Delight in Our Busy Lives. Wayne Muller. Uh, just a short little part from him that I, I just soak in. He says that the problem is not simply that we work too much. The problem is that we're working for the wrong reward. We are paid in the wrong currency. We reward the fruits of our labor and the sweat of our brow with money, goods, and services. We need to seek instead a more fertile, healing balance of payments. Some of our pay in money and some of our pay in time. I mean, what if we were to expand our definition of wealth to include those things that grow only in time? Wow, time to, to walk in the park, to take a nap, to play with the children, to read a good book, to dance, to put your hands in the garden, to cook playful meals with friends etc etc and then he concludes here with you know the sabbath is a revolutionary invitation to consider that the fruits of our labor may be found in the restful and unhurried harvest of time in time we can taste the sweetness of peace serenity well-being and delight the truth must be told with all the money in the world and no time we have nothing at all let us pray oh lord who has gifted us with so much we sometimes forget it's it's all uh, not just the tangible things the things that we can earn with the sweat of our brow, but it, it's all the things you give us that are only cultivated in time. The time you give, the time for us to love and be loved, to uh, feel your spirit, the time that produces nothing, but uh, cares for the depths in our souls. Lord, quiet us down, refocus us, and ever bless us with uh, the abundance of life that you've intended for all of us. My God who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Blessings this week to you for rich times ahead.